Hi everyone. Today we are going to have a look at a particular application called AirDroid for Android devices that lets you share data and do many other functions uh, on your Android device without the use of data cables. So all you need for this particular thing to work is a Wi-Fi connection, uh, your home network will do fine, an Android device and a PC with a web browser. So all you need to have is have a uh, the particular application called AirDroid. I don't know if you can see. Uh, there's a green one. AirDroid of application installed on your particular Android device. So you can easily get it from the Play Store. I'll put the links in the show notes below. And then over here, as you can see, it's mentioning two links. It's saying web.airdroid.com. Uh, we can go to that page also and scan the QR code, or we can put the particular IP that it is giving. So both ways it works. So for example, if you have a device that has a camera, uh, for example, a mobile that will also work fine with that. And for example, a tablet that it does not have a rear facing camera, you can use that. So let's put the IP that it's telling me to do. It's saying 10.0.0.4.888. So let's put it there. Okay, here you can see. Only I have to change this, I have to change this particular portion, it's now telling me and it should connect. So on my device, it's uh, asking me to accept, I will just go and do that. Yeah. So as you can see, this is your interface. It's very simple to use, no complications. So for example, if you want to, now this is a tablet, so there are no such features as call logs and messages and so forth. But for files, you can definitely check that. Check that. Let me go to files. It has a web browser, uh, a file manager kind of thing. So. Okay. Now, let me see. Let me check wallpapers. Okay. So now it's showing the wallpapers that I have on the particular folder. I can see that I can even download them. I can do select a bunch of them and download them. All these functions are available nicely. I can even upload files from here. It's very simple. I go to upload. Then it's asking me to select files. So for example, I go to downloads and then anything that I want I can easily upload it so that's how it works it's very simple and there are other features also for example you want to use the camera of a particular device uh, you click OK and now uh, the front facing camera is being displayed over here as you can see, it's a very uh, 0.3 megapixel camera or something. So images will not be that clear. But if you have a good camera, for example, uh, a better Android device, it de will definitely work. Uh, all these functions are very easy to use. Only thing is that people don't know about these particular applications. Once you start using it, it will come in no time. So thanks for watching. And I hope you like it. If you like it, do share it with others.